Hi guys, welcome to a short review. So Tata has taken out a virtual reality of the Safari and I would like to compare it with the Harrier. So it is very similar to the Safari. You can see that it is a little long from the Safari Harrier. Se. The real difference comes from the back because of the third row in the Safari. Uh, the Harrier doesn't have this third row. You can see that the Harrier is a little shorter than the Safari. And uh, here the real difference comes. The back of the Safari is much taller than the Harrier because of the third row. And it's um, you can see the wide tract of the Safari compared to the Harrier. The Harrier looks considerably smaller in this video. Uh, zyada difference hai nahi, um, otherwise, under se agar dekhiye, to this is the third row of the Safari. Agar hum baithe, aap Harrier dekh sakte ho third row se. You can see where the Harrier ends and where the Safari ends. Um, in terms of the interiors, it's uh, very similar to Harrier. Se. The only, uh, the, you can see Apple CarPlay, the steering model controls. This is the difference that we are seeing. The parking button, is parking brake is different. You can see that the rear of the Safari uh, and the top is very, very similar to the Harrier. You can see the panoramic sunroof, which is also there in the Harrier. This comes with captain seats or the bucket seats as you like to call it. The Safari is much longer because of the third row and it takes to compare it with the Innova. This is from the middle of the Safari. You can see the front which is extremely similar to the Harrier. You can see that the dashboard is alignment exactly like the Harrier with the same design ideology. This is a handbrake. Alaga. It's a button here. This is the Harrier's interiors. You can see this is a not virtual reality. This is a real Harrier. Apple CarPlay, this is the handbrake. You have to put it on your hand and put it on your hand. So that's the main difference between the Harrier and the Safari.